I, Akansha Mahajan, and I, Ria Koshik, stand before you with great pleasure and a sense of pride to not just celebrate, but to acknowledge and appreciate the hard work, dedication, and outstanding achievements of our students. To start with the award giving ceremony, I request Ms. Sonali Arora to take over and announce the achievements of our French students first. Bonjour. I would like to begin with a French quote written by Abbe Pierre. Il ne faut pas attendre d'être parfait pour commencer quelque chose de bien. It means that you don't have to wait for it to be perfect before starting something good. In the month of September, a group of students from MIP 2, 3, 4 enthusiastically participated in French competitions organized by Prayatne Educational Society. It fills, it fills me with great joy and pride to share the fantastic news that several students have brought significant laurels to our school through their commendable performances in, the, in these competitions. Their hard work, dedication, and passion for the French language have truly shown through and it is a moment of immense honor to acknowledge their ac accomplishments. Now I would like to call upon Mr. Sharma on the stage. Can we move on to the next slide? All right, Kanisha Singh secured first rank in the competition called Concours Romo Roland. Let's give a hearty round of applause, please. The second rank was secured by Swarit Garg, Swarit Garg in the same competition. Ashwin Kaur, MYP3 students, secured third position in the same competition called Concours Romo Roland. Now we have another category of competition that is French word pa. Again, the first rank is secured by Kanisha Singh once again. With a score of 90%. Ashmeen Kaur secured second rank in French word pa. And Avika Jain secured third rank. She's absent. Okay. Okay, let's move on to the another category. Okay. We have 13 students who participated and they have called they have got the participation certificates. Can we call all of them on the stage? Olipriya. 
शर्मा प्लाक्षा राठौर कुनाल वडेरा सारा जैन इवान गुप्ता यूरी ली नंदिनी महेश्वरी शनाया जैन ऋषभ गुप्ता युवान गोयल गुरनूर कौर तरशील मारवा एंड स्वरित गर्ग the students have worked really hard to enhance their vocabulary Let's move on to the next category of competition called Grand de la Poet, where two students, Yash, Yash, Yashika Salwan and Monishka Singh, of AS level and DP two, they participated in poetry competition. यशिका सालवान थैंक यू सो मच कॉन्ग्रेचुलेशन टू ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स थैंक यू मिस सोनाली अरोरा Congratulations once again to all the awardees and may I request Mr Sharma to stay on stage to celebrate few more students achievements In every corner of our school we find remarkable individuals who have demonstrated excellence in various fields academic artistic athletic and more It's not just about the awards it's about the spirit of perseverance the commitment to growth and the pursuit of greatness that we honor today the millennium school held an mun in which our students participated and won laurels to our school let's invite plaksha rathor of myp4 for the special mention for verbal skills award many congratulations plaksha let's have the claps going round the corner it should not stop they have done so well next we have jay aditya from dp2 who won the best delegate award congratulations jay aditya now we have dishan nishchal from dp1 who also won the best delegate award Congratulations Prashant Arang of MYP5 got the best journalist award Let's clap for her Anya Bajaj of MYP5 got the best photographer award ये आन्यांग लेट्स हैव अ ह्यूज राउंड ऑफ अप्लॉज फॉर ऑल द स्टूडेंट्स हु हैव वन अस लॉरेल्स इन द एमयूएन थैंक यू मिस्टर शर्मा नाउ आई लाइक टू रिक्वेस्ट मिस जोशी टू कम ऑन स्टेज एंड गिव अवे द अवार्ड्स द फर्स्ट वन इन आवर लिस्ट इज यशवसन बोलेशिटी ऑफ एमवाईपी 2 ए Who has completed all levels of Kumon English program? Congratulations, Yashwasan. <laughs> we 
Following this, we have the students who have participated and received certification of the completion of their course by the Indiana University College of Arts and Science, Bloomington. We have Sara Jain, Anya Bajaj, Disha Nishchil, Ishan Chatterjee, and Parthi Sharma. Many congratulations. Let's have a huge round of applause as they receive the they have received the certification of completion of the creative writing workshop. In the arena of sports, every triumph is a testament to the countless hours of training, the sacrifices made, and the unwavering commitment to excellence. Whether on the field, court, track, or pool, our athletes have showcased not only their physical prowess, but also their mental resilience and determination. So we have a lot of achievements coming up in sports. Please join your hands together for Myra. Myra Marva of MYP2 has got the second position in the Inter-School Gymnastics League. Myra has also received another award, which is the third position at the Gautam Bodh Nagar District Gymnastics Championship. It is so heartening to see you all clap for your friend and increase and boost her morale. Ananya Singh of MYP3 received the second position at the Triumph Open Tennis Championship. Congratulations, Ananya. We have Yashwasin Molishetti coming up next from MYP2 who has who has received the first position in the 10th Stag Telangana State and Inter District Table Tennis Championship. It's a huge achievement, guys. Let's have a huge round of applause for Yashwasin. Congratulations, Yashwasin. Next, we have Yashwasan receiving the third position. Yashwasan, please continue being a Again state. on stage, Yash. For the state ranking table tennis tournament held at Hyderabad. Next, we have Sia Marwa with an amazing accomplishment. She has qualified for the Indian team trials. Yes, Sia. Congratulations. Trials. <laughs> Sia, uh, one more for one more achievement. She has also qualified for Open National through All India Inter School Shooting Tournament. Next, we have Parnika Sharma from NYP4, who has got the first position in the US Kids Golf Tournament. However, Parnika is still in a tournament. So many congratulations, Parnika. We have more achievements backed under the name for Parnika. So we have second position in US Kids Golf Tournament held at Manasar. Let's all celebrate Parnika today. And we have another one, which is second position at the US Kids Golf India Indian Championship League. Many congratulations. Next, we have Sumira Sagar Dua of MYB1, who has received the third position at the Gautam Bodh Nagar District Gymnastics Championship. Congratulations, Sumira. 
we have Arshia Makkar of MYP2 who has won many medals, so I need a continuous applause. Three gold, two silver, one bronze at YMCA Inter School Aquatic Championship. See, we have a huge lot of medals coming in. Congratulations, Arshia. Yuri Lee of MYP2. Arshia. Arshia, let's have the photograph and the, with all the medals and certificate. Congratulations. Next, we have Yuri Lee of MYP2 who has got the first position at the Inter School Gymnastics comp Competition held at JBM International. Yuri, I think you have to stay here for another one, which is the third position at the Gautam Bodh Nagar District Gymnastics Championship. Congratulations, Yuri. I think we have one more, which is in the, as a group award. Yuri and Myra together who have won the third position at the inter-school gymnastics competition held at JBM International. Excellent, Yuri and Myra. Congratulations once again. Next, we have Yashika Salwan of AS Level, who has won a lot of medals, 11 gold, 16 silver and 7 bronze at the Pantag, which is, an a, which is a 3 days horse show. We don't have Yashika around the corner right now. I think she has left after her exams. Congratulations, Yashika. Yashika is also the proud awardee of Global Kids Achievers Award. And we have one more achievement under her name. She recently curated the Incredible India 2 exhibition at the AIFACS Gallery in New Delhi. Mr. Amnendra Kathua, who, was, who is the retired ambassador for India, has also appreciated her efforts and the achievements that she has bagged at such a young age. Now coming to World Scholars Cup. We have a lot of students receiving a lot of awards under this category. So the first one that we have is Ananya Singh Rathor of MYP3. As you can see, there are many accolades under her name in the certificate. And one more thing which is, which is something that I want you all to notice is that it has been signed by Mr. Daniel, who is also the founder of World Scholars Cup. And he was here a month back to address our students. Do we remember? Next we have Gurnoor Kaur of MYP3. Again a lot of accolades under World Scholars Cup. She's also received gold medal and third place junior writer. Next we have Seher Bedi, again of MYP3. A lot of accolades under her name again. We have a silver medal, a gold medal. Congratulations, Seher.
The next set of awards are about the poets. In the delicate dance of syllables and metaphors, our poets have carved out spaces where emotions come to life and stories are told in the most exquisite forms. Today we honor not just the words on the page, but the artistic souls who have poured their hearts into the art of poetry. Wingward Poetry Prize is a national competition, an exceptional opportunity for aspiring writers to showcase their talents and creativity. A total of 1,300 entries were received this year. <coughs> Our three Promethean aspiring writers participated in this competition and received commendation among, amongst best 100 poems acknowledged by Wingwood on their official website. We have Anya Bajaj, <coughs> Kaya Parashar, and Prisha Naran. Congratulations, girls. We are so proud of you. Yes, ma'am. Hi. May I have your attention? Hello, everybody. I hope we have not lost the purpose of this assembly. This assembly is to actually appreciate our friends here. And if we talk, then we don't hear what they are being applauded for. I really want some silence and absorption of this sentiment of, you know, joy and applaud. Please enjoy with us and clap for them rather than having your own personal conversations. This is really required. You know, this assembly is not... <coughs> Some people have already got their awards and it's being repeated because they've got awards outside the school. And they've come here so that we see them. We know our children. We get inspired. So this assembly is not only for the awardees, but for us as an audience to appreciate our own friends here. Let's be in this sentiment with all of us, please. Thank you, Ms. Joshi. We have a few more good news to share, which are an achievement of our own students. We have Rashmi Nair, who has got a total score of 1330 out of 1440, which is the math score percentile comparison if you look at it here on the screen. She has received 690 in the reading and writing section and 640 in the math section. She's in the 96th percentile of our country and 99th percentile overall. We all thank you, Ms. Joshi. Now we also have Suryan Shagarwal of A levels who ranked 167 and Kashmi Gulati ranked 287. Both of them secured their places in the NLUs. Can we clap for them? So these students have written the entrance exam, which is the CLAT for the national law universities, and they have bagged these national ranks. And they are all, uh, they both have been accepted by NLU top, uh, top colleges. So they're not here right now, but can we have a louder round of applause to celebrate their achievement? Next is Manishka of DP2, who has got an acceptance letter from the State University of Pennsylvania for a course in electrical engineering. Congratulations to Manishka. Uh, Manishka, can we have you on stage? Yeah. Can we cl yes. clap for Manishka a little harder? This is a very good achievement. Uh, we would like to invite Mr. Sharma on stage to congratulate the placement of these two students who are here with us. The next one is Anika Kasat. Anika received a first of a letter for a course in economics from the University of Manchester. Congratulations, Anika. 
We are so very proud of your achievement, girls, and we hope that you continue to keep adding feathers in your caps. Okay, may we request Mr. Sharma to address the audience, please? Wow, we've come a long way. Um, I was so happy to see um, you know all these students uh, who got the recognition, and I know many of you who've uh, not uh, received any recognition today. I know that you would have already received it um, in in some other uh, uh, ceremony, but all of you have the potential to uh, make it big, to make a difference in in your own capacity. Uh, congratulations to each one of you. Um, I, I, you know, in addition to this uh, accolades um, ceremony, I also wanted to uh, touch upon certain other aspects. I know that today was your final essay. Is that the correct um, statement, or do do you have one more tomorrow? Uh, Ms. Sonali told me, to, I mean, she had communicated a message that today was the last essay. Is, 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 there, is that not true, Ms. Sonali? For senior grades. Okay. Okay, officially, yes. But anyways, I hope all of you did well with the, in your essays. Are you all happy? That's important. You know, you'll, some of you are going to um, top it. Some of you may need some improvement. But if you work towards topping it, if you work towards, you know, getting the highest marks, you will. I have no doubts. Um, you know, our school, um, not just in sports, in, um, you know, MUN, in um, uh, different types of uh, you know, Global Scholar Awards, Everywhere, you know, I see our students, uh, you know, making uh, um, um, uh, a mark and uh, shining. So um, I, it, it uh, makes me very happy to see uh, Prometheus shining and doing really well. I would like to uh, congratulate our uh, secondary school principal, Ms. Sonali, and the great team that we have. Great team of uh, uh, secondary school, um, you know, coordinators, uh, Ms. Ramit in uh, PE, uh, uh, Director PE. Or head of the department, yeah. And uh, everybody, you know, theater, music, you know, it, it makes me very happy to see where we've um, reached. And um, I, you know, I think I think every day we are raise, raising the bar. I won't say that every academic year we are raising the bar. And, you know, I, I don't think that we could have done it without having a great team in place. So the secondary school, you know, all of you need to give a big round of applause to your teachers, to uh, the secondary leadership. And to each one of you, to each one of you for doing a fantastic job. Now, I, again, I don't want to repeat fire in the belly, but I want to re remind you of the purpose of the school, okay? Why do we exist? You know, I'm happy for both Anika and Monishka. I know they are going to get great experience. They are, they are, they've got admissions in the college of their choice, which is great. But... The possibilities in India are endless. You are part of an international school. That's for international mindset. That's to make you global citizen. The idea is not just to have you know children study here and then go abroad and study you know undergrad. I didn't do my undergrad from uh, US. I did it from India. And irrespective of which college I did, wherever I would have gone, I would have done what I'm doing today. Right? So what is important is what do you really want? What do you really want to do in your life? What do you want to leave behind? You know, every day is important. Think about where you want to be uh, five years from now, ten years from now. And don't just aim for the universities outside of India. Please figure out the good universities that we have in India. You know, and if you align your thoughts and your goals with the school's vision, I am very confident that we'll make a big difference. You know, uh, as you grow, 
I am sure you would want to contribute towards the uh, towards the betterment of your family, your home. Yes or no? Yes. When you are thinking about your home, you have to think about your community. You have to think about your city. You have to think about your country. When we are not in India, we are abroad doing whatever that we are doing. What are we contributing? Fine. I mean, you know, you are probably sending some money to parents or whatever. I mean, uh, you know, we are probably uh, getting some foreign currency. But is that what we need? Can't we work together to make India shine? We have come a long way. We are the um, you know one of the um, nations where you'll see significant growth in the coming days. I don't know if um, this will change your mind, but please start thinking about what is it that I can do for my family, for my school, for my city, and for my nation. All right. With that, uh, I once again congratulate each one of your. On, on your accomplishments I, and I wish you um, happy holidays, uh, Merry Christmas, we are going to have Christmas Carnival um, and I hope that um, I get to see the uh, participation from secondary school. Next year we will have to think about whether this Christmas Carnival is um, for the students, by the students because it is not by the students. I don't see much coming from the students. Yes or no? Yeah, I, I don't think that there is uh, uh, you know, any uh, great contribution uh, made by the uh, students of uh, the school. Organizing an event of this magnitude will help you learn multiple skills. Collaboration, leadership, negotiation. Those of you who have uh, signed up for stall, you will get to, you'll get to you know, learn financial literacy on the ground. These practical experiences are important and remember, all of us are going to have fun. Even if somebody is, um, you know, signed up for stall, it doesn't mean that the individual will not be able to have fun on the day of Christmas carnival. You know, we, we are a team. All right. Happy holidays. Love you all. Keep, keep shining and keep uh, raising the bar for Prometheus School. Thank you again.